hey y'all today i'm doing a first impression on some maybelline products that i was sent that um i'm very excited about and trying i usually don't fill in my brows but today i actually filled them in and i think i like them like i never really filled my brows and i'm in between needing my eyebrows wax and so I'm in between appointments um they sent me a couple of colors which I do like because um they gave me like all the way from blonde to auburn I think that is absolutely perfectly fine because I'm a girl who wear weaves who wear weave I'm a girl who wears wigs and weaves and I wear different colors so like for my brows to be a little lighter when I want to wear a lighter color I think that's perfectly fine that's why I like to kind of change up my eyebrows so I can do it without tinting them or actually dyeing them this is like a good alternative so they are called the Maybelline New York brow define plus fill in duo by eye studio I love Maybelline you guys know if you look at my little list of foundation reviews I do Maybelline I love Maybelline Maybelline's my favorite so when I first started applying the thing I noticed that they didn't have the color actually on them so I kind of got lost but I guess you're supposed to tell the different colors by the um the tips of the powder area this is like the powder region and this one is the actual eyeliner now the soft brown and the deep brown kind of look alike so first you just want to comb your brows i don't know where my brow spoolie is but yeah make sure the brow area is dry i did use baby oil so yeah so i want to take this one and what I'm gonna do is basically follow my actual brow line. And kind of create a little tip. Then I'm just gonna go in with light stroke. And I kind of want the brow to kind of square off there. Give me like an extended lift. So if you make it too thick, you can basically um, contour it with the, well sculpt it, not contour, sculpt it with the actual concealer, but that is how I did mine. And I didn't go in the front, I'm going to use the light color, but before I use the light color, I'm going to go to the other brown. Oh, I think this one is deep, I don't know, but I'm going to use this one. This one seems to be a little bit darker, and I'm going to follow the same steps. I'm gonna take this one, which this one should be Auburn. So I'm gonna take Auburn for my front brow region. This is the color of Auburn's um, cap. So I'm gonna fill her in. And I just do little strokes flaring up like that. So, now it is time to set the brow. So I'm gonna set the brow with this powder uh, of this cap and just gonna turn it and kind of pop it in there like that. And what I'm gonna do is just do the same thing, light strokes through the brow. <laughs> Okay, I found my spoolie, which I needed a lot. So what I'm going to do is just basically brush all of that in there. And I know I look crazy in this region, so I'm just going to take my concealer and I'm going to sculpt my actual brow. just sculpt it like that and this is the time when you can actually fill in some more which I am going to do in this region I'm just gonna take this brush it'll take um, less time with blending so I'm just gonna kind of tap it in with the brush I'm just gonna take my um, 
little mattifying powder and just kind of set the brow. And I'm going to fill in some regions that I missed. What I did was I added some concealer and I didn't blend it in. I'm just tapping it in with the pressed powder so it can set like a defined cover up because I'm really trying to cover up the extra hairs. So I do think this is a cheaper alternative for the Anastasia Beverly Hills Dip Down which is like a gel form but this one's like a cream liner. I think this is like a good alternative for us drugstore girls who like to use drugstore products and we mainly can't afford the high end stuff. This is a very inexpensive way to fill in your brows and get the fullness that you like and I do like it. I think it's easy. It's easy to use and maneuver. I do little light strokes and I got my brows bam and they're full and thick and I think I might start doing this because I am filling this full brow look like I never did the fullness I never filled them in we'll have links below for it and if I can find some coupons or anything or retail me not or if they have like a or if they have like coupons on their site or anything I will have that link below so I hope you guys check out this product I do recommend these brow duels so hope you all enjoyed this quick little video and I'll see you in the next one